Young E, the posthumous work of the late actress Kang Soo Yun, maintained the number one spot on Netflix global top movie chart for three consecutive days. According to Flix Patrol on January 24, Young E ranked number one as the most watched movie on Netflix. The film ranked number one in 41 countries, including South Korea, Belgium, Brazil, Chile, France, Hong Kong, the United States, Mexico, Malaysia, South Africa, and more the previous day. Young E was released on January 20 and takes place in the backdrop of the near future when the Earth becomes barren and unlivable due to climate change. The story unfolds when war breaks out in a refuge made by humankind, and the brain of a mercenary Young E is cloned and used to develop a combat AI. Director Yun Seng Ho, who directed films such as Train to Pusan and Netflix original series Hellbound, picked up the megaphone for this film. Additionally, this is the last movie filmed by the late actress Kang Soo Yun, who passed away suddenly in May of last year. Kang Soo Yun played the role of Yoon Seo Yoon, the team leader who is leading the development of combat AI at the research center. In an interview with Star Today, director Yun Sang Ho shared, she passed away shortly after finishing all the filming and recordings. She was really curious about how the film would be completed. She always would say I thought I would be able to see it, completed version, today every time she came to film. It really hurts my heart that I wasn't able to show her the completed work because this was her comeback piece for the first time in a long time. Kim yun yo who played the role of young E, also shared at the production presentation on January 12, I still remember the first day I met my senior, Kang Soo Yun. On set, she didn't assert her authority as a senior but she was just a colleague. She was more sincere and passionate than anyone else. Meanwhile, there have been mixed reactions to the film after its release. While many praised the visual effects and computer graphics, there were harsher reviews for the story setting and plot progression.